Human zombies might be a figment of the imagination, but zombie bees actually exist. They are created when regular honeybees get infested with a particular type of parasite. The bees begin to display highly erratic and bizarre behavior that's very zombie-like. These infested bees were first discovered in 2008 in California by John Hafernick, a professor of biology at San Francisco State University. Ever since the initial discovery, zombie bee sightings have been reported in Oregon, Washington State, California and South Dakota. According to Professor Hafernick, they fly around in a disoriented way, get attracted to light, and then fall down and wander around in a way that's sort of reminiscent of zombies in the movies. Sometimes we've taken to calling it, when they leave their hives, the flight of the living dead. Apostrophe The culprit here is the Apocephalus borealis, a parasitic fly that is known to implant its eggs in ants. The fly larvae live off the ants' brains, dissolve their connective tissues and eventually finish off the ants. Researchers now have reason to believe that the flies have found a new home for their eggs, European honeybees that are common in the United States. The flies lay their eggs in the bees that eventually hatch, wreaking havoc in their hosts' bodies. The zombie-like behavior begins as soon as the bees have been infested with eggs. Once the eggs hatch, the bees drop dead within five minutes. Several bees in commercial hives have been affected by this phenomenon. 24 out of 31 sites in the San Francisco Bay Area have reported honeybees parasitized by A. Borealis. Thankfully, there isn't a real threat of zombie, bee, invasion happening anytime soon. At least, that's what Professor Hafernick believes. Oh, yeah.